It's Dr. Searcy with your video summary for the day. Today we started talking about the English Renaissance and specifically the poetry of Thomas Wyatt. Our quotation for the day came from Thomas Wyatt's sonnet, Whoso List to Hunt, which was a modified remix of a Petrarchan sonnet. The final couplet says, Noli me tangeri, for Caesar's I am, and wild for to hold, though I seem tame. Now these words are engraved around a diamond encrusted necklace that the deer has around its neck. We talked today about how this sonnet that this couplet concludes is a lyric poem that is a short poetic form that emphasizes the emotions of a personal speaker, a first person speaker. And here we have a story of desire, how a man knows that the woman he's chasing is wrong for him, how he urges others if they want to get in the chase, but he's going to give it up, how he realizes that he can't give that chase up. And then finally, our conclusion in the in the final couplet, the rhyming couplet, of course, a couplet being two successive rhyming lines, that this woman belongs to Caesar, that the words around her neck are probably not her own, that she's been spoken for by the king. Given Thomas Wyatt's history as a diplomat, history as a man charged with sleeping with Anne Boleyn, the wife of the king. This poem's irony, its concluding bite, takes on a slightly more tragic sense. We'll continue talking about the Renaissance on Thursday as we look at the letters and speeches of Queen Elizabeth.